Hello and welcome to the Vaccination Weekly Roundup. I'm Tim Peplo and here are this week's biggest stories. The American Academy of Pediatrics has called for all children aged six months and over to receive the influenza vaccine as soon as possible. The AAP also recommended receiving either the trivalent or the new quadru quadrivalent vaccines, but stopped short of endorsing one over the other. And this year's flu season in the US will be the first to feature quadrivalent vaccines. And when it comes to getting vaccinated, the AAP says it's more important to receive either vaccine than to delay getting a vaccine at all. The UK is to embark on a universal campaign to vaccinate the elderly with Sanofi Pasteur MSD's Zostafax vaccine against shingles, on the advice of the UK's Joint Committee on Vaccination and Immunisation. Initially, because of levels of availability of the vaccine, only those adults aged 70 and 79 will be offered Zostavax, and around 800,000 people will be eligible for the shingles vaccine in the first year. Adjuvants are increasingly being recognised as critical components for the next generation of vaccines, and if new vaccines are to target unmet needs, new adjuvants are needed to improve poor immunogenicity, and therefore we've put together an article on six novel adjuvants in development to highlight the wide variety of adjuvants currently being evaluated. We've also been looking at some of the top conspiracy theories against vaccination, so click the link to read the article and give us your thoughts. And finally, this week's feature presentation is from Dr Mark Gills of the European Vaccine Initiative on the challenges of validating immunogenicity assays for vaccines. That's all, thanks for watching and we'll see you again next week.